Hey, what's up everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're back in round two of the water comparison series. We're going to compare all five of these waters and decide which one I personally think is the best. So we're going to start off with these two Chinese waters. We have Alk Aqua and Run Tam water. I'm going to start off with these two because these two are both flavorless. Now, I've reviewed all these in the past. I have a general idea of what these two taste like. And I don't want to contaminate the flavors of these during the test with these three, because these three have like added flavors to them. So I'm gonna just start off with these two. Here's the uh, Run Tam Natural Selenium Mineral Water. It's a good one. Um, yeah, no bad aftertaste. And um, the reason that these two are already open and halfway gone is because um, I only have two bottles of each of them, and I have to make them last throughout this review series because they're from China. Um, one of my viewers sent them to me from China. And I've got two two more of them. If they, if they win and make it to the next round. Yeah, they're pretty close. Okay, I think that the winner is the, uh, this one. The Run Tam Natural Selenium Mineral Water. Just between these two, this is the better tasting one. This has like a maybe a slight, like almost a, a rubbery taste to it. No smell. Just like a kind of a slight weird taste of um, you know, almost like a rubber to it. And it's so slight that I wouldn't notice unless I was looking for it. Unless I was trying to you know, look for a flaw in it. But just going back and forth, this one is the winner. Alright, so this is out. Let's move on to these three. Start with the Oral IV. This one has a ton of claims to it. And in my first review of this water, I basically called it snake oil. I, I literally called it snake oil. And I recommended people not buy it because it's it's basically just tap water and they don't say what else they add to it. Like, they don't clarify what else is in it. But they make all these crazy claims about it. it smells like mint. Yeah, let's taste it. It, it tastes like a mint slash pool like swimming pool water slash like it kind of tastes like cologne smells like you know mildly a very mild cologne that's like the taste of it but I mean I have to obviously I have to eliminate this because it's not as much of a water as this is a water. And this is like a super expensive one. It's really overpriced. So yeah, this is eliminated. Um, let's move on to the Pussy Willow water. It's got a really strong smell of like flowers. I was thinking it might be a funny prank to just open this up on like a public bus or maybe an airplane somehow just because it's like it's such a strong smell once you open it it would just be a funny like prank to see people's reaction yeah it tastes like uh flowers like almost like a, a cleaning product This is 90 servings, so you're only supposed to drink a tiny amount of this. It's supposed to be mixed with other 
beverages, other waters, other sugar waters, and you're supposed to use it for cooking. This is four dollars. I'm just gonna eliminate eliminate this now because um, it's got a really strong you know pussy flavor to it, and compared to the Runtan water, it's not as good. So I'm going to eliminate this. the bloom honey water I would actually recommend checking out the round one video of this it's kind of interesting I got to interview the uh, the CEO of bloom honey water or one of the two CEOs so it was a neat experience this smells like the harmless harvest coconut water it's got like a barky scent to it This does taste good. I, I actually like the taste of this. If I could afford it, I would probably drink this regularly. It's, you know, it's like a honey flavor. This is the vanilla version. It's like honey slash vanilla slash, you know, a bark, like a tree bark flavor to it. It is, it's good, but it's not really a water. Like if I had someone do a blind taste test of this, I don't think anybody would say, oh, this is water. They would they would describe it in many ways, but they wouldn't call it water. Uh, 70 calories in it, in this small bottle. It's like not even a huge bottle, it has 70 calories. So this one is the winner. This is moving on to the round three. But I just wanna say out of these three, this is tough. I guess I would say this is the the worst because it has the calories. It's the best tasting, but the worst overall. Um, then these two are kind of just tied for flavor. And this one's kind of hard to judge because it's so it's such a small amount of water. But I would say that these two are kind of tied just for the uh, the flavor. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Um, Congratulations, run tan water. Run tan. Run tan and run tan.